Hi, I'm William Everhart, Director of Training here at Lodestone, and I have another quick tip for you. Are you an Adobe user in the market for more digital real estate? You know, more room to work without the bother of those pesky yet very handy panels getting in your way. Well, I've got a tip here that'll help you move that out of the way and reclaim some of that real estate. Let's take a look. Here I have my InDesign document open and I'm working on a laptop with a really small screen. So this real estate here, the, the area in which my document occupies, is at a premium. So I've got tools over on the left and panels over here on the right and just sometimes I'd like to get that stuff out of my way. Well here's the real quick tip. If you hit the tab key, now this only works if you're not editing text, but hit that tab key and those panels just disappear. Awesome. Hit the tab key, they pop right back. There's something even better here at work. If I hit that tab key again and hide those panels, and I say, well, you know, I'd like to get another tool here. Well, I just move my mouse over to the left side of my screen. Just past my ruler, there's a little dark gray bar. When I mouse over it, look what happens. My tool panel pops open. I grab a different tool, mouse away from the panel, and guess what? The panel closes. Now, that's pretty cool, but check out over here on the right. If I go over here to the far right of my screen, there's a little gray bar over there as well, and if I mouse over it, Hey, there's all my panels, including the little button panels like my media and all these other ones here. So if I just click on one of those, those panels pop open. Now I can do whatever it is I need to do and then mouse away from the panel and guess what? They all close right back up. Pretty cool, but the only problem I have is that little control panel at the top. Unfortunately, this doesn't work with the control panel at the top. You can mouse up at the top all you want. It's not going to happen. So, you know, you can always use the little tab key to bring that back and hide and show your panels anytime you like. Now, for an extra bonus here, instead of just hitting the tab key, hold down the shift key, then hit the tab key. Look what happens. My control panel stays, my tool panel stays, but all those other panels, they have been hidden. Gives me a little more screen real estate. And the same effect applies if I mouse over the right-hand side of the screen. The panels pop open, I mouse away from them, the panels close up. So that's it. Two quick tips all rolled into one. Like I said, you can use this in just about any Adobe application. So give it a shot. Thank you for watching. For more quick tips or more in-depth training, please go to www.lodestone.com.